What's good to you know what is perfect to send to what's up and welcome back to another FIFA 17 experiment video and you guys really seem to like these kind of videos my postman domination video seems to get really good support so I'm doing another one now and this time I'm gonna see what happens if I put all the world's best bench players in a team of Accrington so yeah the lowest ranked team in English football or FIFA anyways so I got all the good players like Aguero because Pep Guardiola seems to play Gabriel Jesus when he's not injured before Aguero so that's why Aguero's in the team then got players like Shirley, Pedro, Fabregas, you know it man and Casemiro, no no Casemiro, Isco and James after the first season league table we really smashed it 115 points only 3 losses it's got 118 goals man only 24 so that's a really good result for us and yes, it was easier than I thought but Portsmouth got quite a lot of points, 94 and you can see after the first season score reports there Begovic played a lot of matches and Pepe 27 Dina our left back, we got uh, Fabregas, I only played 21 matches he wasn't in my starting 11 so that's the reason behind that and then Aguero only played 27 matches, scored 5 goals so not good enough I thought he would smash the league goals in the league too man, Asensio 27 goals, 48 matches and uh, bear in mind I didn't put him in my starting 11 he was on the uh, bench so for some reason the computer starts to play our bench player more than our starting 11 players I don't know why but yeah that's the reason here and then a few other players Ben Arfa, Vermaelen, Montil Montil Montolivo played 45 matches Lennon also a top scorer for us and you can see their uh, attributes yeah, Matteo is 33, so yeah, the stats will go down. And Dina up by one, Sarnsha get down by two, James up by one, 88 overall now. And then like, we're nothing at all, and then Shirley plus two. Asensio is a really big star for our team, even though it was for our bench player. But when I sim the matches, no, the monthly sim, the computer, or the AI decided to play him as a starter. I don't know why, but yeah, it works out. And then Origi and some other real Accrington players there and then you can see top league scorers Leno 24 and Asensio 23 our cam and our right winger both of them were in our reserves or uh, the bench yeah assist as well Asensio with 15 and Begovic 24 clean sheets that's uh, really good man a uh, bit disappointed not seeing uh, Aguero top scorer but yeah in the second season we smashed it once again but then Rotterdam 103 points, how did Manchester get that many points? I have no idea, but yeah, and Coleman this time, Kingsley Coleman, 29 goals, our top scorer, and no one else there, and assists, we got Coleman and Asensio with 9 each, and then goalkeeper stats, well, clean sheets, uh, Begovic once again, and uh, yeah, Matteo still going down, he's now 77 rated player, Begovic uh, 58 matches, I mean, that's a hell of a lot of matches, a hell of a lot of clean sheets and Dinia us plus by two, up by two. And Fabri has gone down by one now, he's 31 years old. Renato Sanchez only played 30 matches. And James played 32, up by one, so 89 overall after two seasons. Well, after, yeah, after two seasons. And Aguero only played 26 matches, only scored eight goals in the league, 12 in the whole season. So, yeah, he doesn't get that much play time. And Shirley Asensio by 2 now, 86, 37 matches, scored 15 goals, something like that, I think it was. And Gaetan didn't play any matches at all for some reason, he wasn't my starting 11, but hey, the computer decides, and yeah, they, want, they didn't want to play him. And Rashford, Kingsley, Coleman, 36 goals in 52 matches, 29 in the league, 40 matches in the league, so that's a really good goal ratio for him. And Stephen Sharavi, Honda, Gibbs, you know, Lennon is 31 now. And Schweinsteiger went down by two as well. You can see the stats, nothing at all from Vidal. And Digne, yeah, pretty good man. Overall, plus two. Fabregas got down Sana Sanchez. And James Rodriguez up by one. But the best player of all time, not all time, but yeah, Asensio on this team, man. Up by two, 86 rated by now. And yeah, other than that, still uh, Rashford up by two. 98 acceleration, man. That's uh, really, really good. Soon he will take in Aguero's spot, not in this next season, but I think it's season 4 or 5, I can't really remember. And then Moreno up by 1, Batshuayi up by 1, Israel up by 1, Honda down by 2. And Swansteg, yeah, because of his age, and there you can see the third season, still top of the table, we won the league once again, 3 losses, 
35 wins, 94 goals scored, but had 113 points, and then Swansea got 100 points. I mean, they got nowhere near as good a place that we have, and still they managed to get 100 points. But yeah, some reason they managed, but then Sheffield, Charlton, and Birmingham who were relegated. We knocked out the semi-finals in the FA Cup by Man City, who's now playing the league, like, the final against Chelsea. You can see top score with Coma in 19, only third place, and Swansea had two 20 goal strikers. Well, yeah, that's a bit weird, man. And then uh, we have Moreno, our left back, scored 11 goals. That's just insane. And assist Honda with 10. Uh, yeah, our left backs were our top scorer. Well, the second top scorer, and clean sheets there. But Begovic only got nine clean sheets, eight in the league. And Matteo still going down, same as Pepe going down as well. And Fabregas also going down, but Sanchez going up. And James is now a 90 overall rated player. That's really good, man. And Aguero doesn't get that many playtime, even though once again he's in our starting 11. But when I sim the matches, the AI starts to play our reserves and bench plays before him. I don't know why, but yeah, EA gotta fix that. And you can see stats. Oops, no change for Vidal. And Matteo, yeah. I didn't expect anything other than that. Same with Pepe. Dino went up and Fabregas went down. Lost out with Sanchez. A lot of stats went up and same with Juanes. And Pedro was really damn crazy. Like, really fast. And Asensio, man. 92 acceleration already. That's insane. I think he has like 98 of the five seasons. That's yeah, more than I could ever think of. And then Kingsley Coleman in National Restroom. All of them gone up. So yeah, good to see their developments. Schweinsteiger, you are very old man, you need to leave. But yeah, I think I took a look at uh, Moreno because he scored 11 goals. Yep, 11 goals. 41 matches in the Premier League, scored 11 goals, that's pretty good. And this is our team of the th three or four seasons, I think. I put Isco and Sanchez on instead of Fabregas and uh, Schweinsteiger because they were getting old now and they were not as good as before and also Vermalen instead of Matteo because Matteo, yeah, only 74 rated player now and then also here you can see all the players I have here are on the reserves and for some reason when I sim the matches the computer says that hey you gotta play man I don't know why but yeah Rashford 85, Ian Ash 84, Common 86, Götze 88 and Asensio 88 but now into the Premier League after 4 seasons and halfway through, Arsenal are leading the league and we are 14th place. Only 5 wins, only 24 points, only 2 behind Man City. For some reason who plays like shit. But well, we do have a top score Aguero from Man City. But yeah, Arsenal are leading. I needed to buy a new centre back because I didn't have any good options. So I bought this other buddy I had in my Man City kit. Uh, career must I know that he is quite good. And also the board came to me and said that we need to buy a new centre back because if we got injured now with centre backs we don't have a replacement. And yeah, that was actually true. And now I was comparing Coleman to Shirley. So it's like, hey, Coleman you're on, he was better than Shirley. And also better rating. And same with Rashford and Aguero. Look at those stats, 99 sprints before Rashford. And he has low defensive striker, that's a really good and that's why he's on to the uh, striker position instead of Aguero and essentially those stats man but after four seasons now Chelsea won the league, Arsenal dropped down to second place Man City fourth, Spurs to say we climbed up to sixth place from 14 to sixth place that's really good I thought we could uh, go into the top five spot but we were one point off that spot man that was a big disappointment for us because we have a really decent squad we should smash at least top five but hey we couldn't win everything but i'm still happy with that only score f 51 goals not good enough and west Brom, Middlesbrough, and aston villa are relegated you can see that copper euro by leverkusen one and then champions league final arsenal with arsenal faces juventus that's never gonna happen in real life man also can't even uh, get past round of 16 man and you can see those stats in james in 91 renato sanchez 85 and Bachuari got down a bit, as, uh, Rashford 87, Coleman 87, and Iannaccio 87, now Sensio there, a really good player, the best player you, to have in Karim in my opinion, and then yeah, all the old players gone down in stats, no big surprise there man, Begovic 32 years old, didn't go down any stats at all, that's a big surprise, then our young players really gone up, 
Big Statues, example, Kamez, only one reaction there. 91 rating, Bakshuai, nothing at all. Rashford gone up, the same as uh, Yanacho and uh, Coleman will, because he's 87. All three of them are 87 rated player by now. 19 acceleration, 96, the same acceleration as Yanacho. 99, 99 spring speed, that's sick. So Ian, uh, Asensi also has 99 acceleration, that's just insane, man. And Aguirre is now 31 years old and he is downgrading very, very fast. And Moya, our goalkeeper, then Pepe, 37, still 75 rated centre back. That's pretty good, man. 37 year old, so yeah, not too bad, eh? But here you can see the top score Arsenal, the Sanchez, 15 goals. And yeah, when we came to the Premier League, we didn't score as many goals as we did in the lower leagues. So no one in our top 20 spot. Assist. Uh, Asensio with 6, so uh, that's good, and now uh, Moya and Begovic in the clean sheets, Begovic got 8, and Moya 6, and you can see some stats on the players that I was surprised of, because I didn't think they would have that good stats after, yeah, 5 seasons, 4 or 5 seasons, I can't remember, and Rashford, look at those stats, man, then Asensio all dark green almost, almost dark green stats, and then uh, Bamez, look at that, 99 long shots, if you take shots with him, yeah, most likely to go in, man. And then Asensio on the bench, 89 rated. Look at those stats. 91 vision, 95 acceleration, 92 ball control. It's insane, 90 long pass. You can play everywhere in the midfield. That's a really good play to have. And it's quite cheap to buy in career mode if you want to buy him. And he will have uh, almost over 90 rated in a few seasons. For me, it's 90, 89 because I didn't play him that much. But yeah, that's it for this video. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video and want to see more of these kind of experiment videos because I really enjoy them and you guys seem to enjoy it as well. And if you're new around here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And yeah, thanks for watching. This is more Ventures. Until next time, thank you. Come again.